A combination of prominent trends from the 50s, 60s and 70s create a lively yet glamorous finish to any interior design. Top this off with highly textured decorations, you get yourself an amazing mid-century modern interior. Season is honoured to be once again awarded the open tender to design HDB's My Nice Home Gallery. Let's have a look at this beautiful two-room unit. Today I'm here with Colin from Season and we're going to get to the bottom of the thought process behind this beautiful renovation. So Colin, what exactly is mid-century modern? So it's actually a combination of 50s to 70s trend and lifestyle. So as you can see over here, some of the things are actually uh, vintage. Come, let's move on to the kitchen. Ah, so it's an open concept kitchen. Yes, as you can see this kitchen, although it's not very big, but you can actually have extra, you know, worktop. Ah! This countertop you can use to prepare food. This kitchen looks so much bigger with all these things stowed away. Let's head on to the living room. For the living room, as you can see, there's a touch of vintage. Yeah, I love the pop of blue and orange brown. I like the different vintage elements and the different textures. Colin, even though this is a two-room unit, right? How do you manage to utilize this space so well? Because it really looks quite spacious when I first walked. Well, because it's an open concept, every place is all open up. But when it comes to bedtime, you can actually close this door. It feels like this bedroom is a part of the living room as well. So this is so easy to close and open. So let me show you something really cool. This writing desk can be converted to a dresser. So when you do work, you can just close it down, use your laptop and when you're getting ready to go out, you can just pull up the mirror. Very, very handy. Let's check out the last room. You can actually use this as a study room or a caregiver room. Close this table, then flip it down. Okay, and then uh, just remove the chair. Easily you can flip down the bed. Oh wow, I did not even notice right? there's a bed inside there. And for extra storage, well, you can actually put your pillow. This is very handy because in the night, you can just use it as a bedroom. And anytime you need space to do your things, it could be a study table as well. Colin, what can homeowners consider when they're designing a smaller space like this two-room unit? A homeowner can consider dual functionality, like this uh, flip down bed, writing desk, flip up uh, it as a, a dresser. dresser. Yes. For the bathroom, we actually add on some cove lightings. Thank you so much, Colin, for showing me around this two-room unit today. And it really looks very spacious compared to your conventional two-room unit. Thank you guys so much for joining me today and we'll see you next time. A trusted interior partner, Season.